Hi everybody, I am Parna again with you all with a new topic. Do you know the intriguing facts about the inchworm? You probably didn't know. Many of you have a come across inchworms in your garden. However, these small creatures have many interesting facts that are worth knowing. Did you know there is an exercise called inchworm? It is called so because it involves an up and down motion similar to that of an inchworm on a flat surface. Each worms aren't worms but are actually caterpillars that belong to Geometridae family of moths. This family have about 35,000 different species in the world. Furthermore, about 1400 kinds of geometer moths are known to live in North America. These caterpillars are also referred to as loopers, snappers or measuring worms. Here we give you the many interesting facts about each worms that will help you know about their peculiar movement. The reason behind their unusual name and other attributes like their appearance, habitat, eating habits, life cycle and more. Appearance These caterpillars are small, hairless and have fewer legs as compared to other species. They are about 1 inch in length and can be green, brownish, grey or black in color. This usually depends on the type of moth they would become. Some of them are also known to have black spot on their head. Their legs are located only on the front and black portion of their body. Locomotion the term geometrodi is believed to have come from a Greek world meaning earth measurer. This meaning can be applied to the peculiar movement that each worms have. Since they have no legs in the middle portion of their body, they need to pull their hind portion forward forming a loop and then move forward with the front portion of their body. Habitat They are usually found in regions with a temperature climate. They are said to live in areas near their food sources like oaks, lidens, elms, maple, apple and other fruit trees. Defense Mechanism They are believed to be hunted or preyed on by some types of bird, lizards and wraps. On sensing a possible predator, they become still and resemble a twig. They bear markings that appear like those on barks of or left sack scarves. They have the ability to come fledge in order to stay protected from predators. They are known to produce silk that they hang from. In case of danger, they drop quickly from the leaves they feed on and hang from the end of the silken strand. Once it's safe, they get back up and continue eating. Eating Habits Single each worms does not eat much. However, it is said that a large hungry group of each worms can cause serious damage to trees and bushes like those of apple and mulberry and most garden plants. Most of their species are believed to feed on leaves of deciduous and coniferous trees. However, there are some that eat lichen, flowers or pollen. Furthermore, there are some of such Hawaiian species of genius Euputhikia that belong to the carnivorous group as well. Canker worms are a species of each worm that are believed to be destructive and are also considered as pests by farmers and gardeners. A pathogen named Bacillus thuringiensis is used to their infestation caused by them. Life cycle Each worms are generally believed to have a lifespan of one year. They are known to grow into an adult geometer moth. The size of such an adult moth ranges from 3 to 8 of an inch to 2 inches from one wing tip to the other. The male moths are known to have a wingspan of about an inch whereas the family's mo female moths are wingless. A geometer moth, meter moth. Adult geometer moths are considered similar to butterflies in the way they keep their wings erect on landing which is not the case with many other moths. They are generally said to be active during the night. However, there are some species that are active during the day as well. During winter, adult moths are known to lay large cluster of grey cylindrical eggs on the branches of trees. In this way, one generation in each of the species is born annually. The eggs hatch in spring. Once hatched, the larvae feed on leaves till it time from them to develop into pupa. This feeding on leaves would be around 5 weeks. They then spin slicking cocoons and go below the ground encased in it until they emerge as fully grown adults. Related post. Intriguing facts about pandas everyone should know. Pandas are a unique species of beard that can be found in China. Pandas are carnivorous yet 99% of them feed on bamboos. They can eat for 16 hours at a. Ridiculous intriguing facts about crocodiles. Remember the Hollywood moves like placid. This first thing that may come to your mind is a gigantic bloodthirsty creatures inhabiting the lake. Crocodile apart from being the largest. Seriously intriguing facts about snapping turtles. Snapping turtles are among the largest freshwater turtles in the world. 
They are aggressive in nature and snap readily when they